Let's learn how to set up a two-point calibration from an image of a ruler to convert measurements in pixels into real-world units such as millimeters. Looking under the image processing functions, find image calibration. First thing I'm going to do is give this a particular step name. I'll call this calibrate image and in my collection of images in the browser I pull up my image of a ruler. The point distance calibration is the simplest calibration that's available. What you want to do is find two points that define a distance on the ruler. I'm going between my 30 millimeter mark and the 130 millimeter mark. That's a total of 100 millimeters and whatever unit you choose here is the unit that will be used for subsequent real-world uh, measurement reports. You can also adjust the location of the origin. If we look at the full-size image, the origin by default is in the upper left corner. You can place this anywhere you like. For example, I can say here's my origin and I want the x-axis to be lined up along my ruler this way. Or perhaps here's supposed to be the origin and I'll line up along this edge of the ruler. Or if uh, it suits you, you could say here's my origin and I need to line it up this way. So you can really place the origin anywhere you like and at any angle that you like. You can also type these values in directly if that's more convenient. I'll go back to the defaults where it was in the upper left corner. The calibration itself is contained in the comments section of a PNG image. I'll save this as calibration demo. And now all subsequent processing steps can make use of measurements in terms of real-world units, in this case millimeters, in addition to pixels if you like.